Good day, citizens of Gotham and all the ships at sea. Currently, 15 paintings of Outworlder 3 Judgment have been completed, leaving 115 more to go. If you saw my recent Facebook posts, then you know that I also tailored an Outworlder suit. Realize that plenty of people can write a script, draw a character, and even voice them. But if only a few of us can draw the patterns, cut the fabric, sew it all together, and install zippers. However, more creators are doing this now. Have a look. So, why make an Outworlder suit? One reason is to act out scenes in future productions, or for costume promotion on social media or at science fiction and comic book conventions. I cannot afford an ex exhibition hall or a dealer's table. So I use the suit to move around the convention hall to meet potential fans. While I am planning 16 more Outworlder videos, the larger plan is to create the Outworlder virtual experience. Now remember, time was, I didn't add a digital paint, I didn't know how to use Apple Final Cut Pro or GarageBand or any other programs. Still made the thing. I still got uh, Outworld the Ultimate Edition, Outworld the 2D Verizon, quite a number of other productions finished. So, it's true, I have no ability to computer generate characters or locations. I have no ability to program a multi layer game or even understand HTML code. Yet, but imagine a game where you play as the Outworld or Diva and prosecute a variety of missions. Perhaps Astro Force's new starship has an experimental warp engine that accidentally rips open a quantum tear in space where many different realities overlap in existence once. Or another scenario where you respond to a distress call to uh, cure a disease outbreak or to another planet to prevent an extinction level event. Imagine also a first contact scenario with an alien species that you would have to learn to communicate with. We're not always going to be doing combat stories. Quite a uh, variety of other uh, scenarios that can be played out with this whole thing. See, the future is in fan-made content, be it videos, comics, or even computer games. That's right, we're going back to the cottage industry. Gratitudes for all your continued interest, Gothamites, and to the United States Marine Corps, a well-deserved 244th birthday, Semper Fi.